A local 13 year old who created such a special bond with Bryce Harper died this week after a three year battle with brain cancer. Bryce Harper called Gavin Rupp a hero. Horace Holmes joins us with the story. Horace. Gordon, this is a remarkable story of courage, of giving and inspiration and the bond between a big time baseball star and a young boy in the fight of his life. Who inspired who more? Well, it's hard to tell. It was one of those unbelievable, unforgettable moments in a young boy's life. On July 5th, 13 year old Gavin Rupp threw out the first pitch at a Washington Nationals game. His baseball hero and new friend Bryce Harper caught the ball. It, it was a day that kind of changed the rest of his days. You know, it, all of a sudden he went from, you know, being very sad and, and upset about the fact that we couldn't do anything else for the cancer to forgetting about that and, and having a, an incredible day. That was July 5th. Yesterday afternoon, Gavin Rupp finished his 30 month battle with brain cancer. News of his death reached Harper following his game last night in Detroit, and Harper sent out this tweet, I will be playing for this young man. Gavin is my hero. And in my message to Bryce last night, I said, I just wish you could have known him sooner. Bryce Harper and the Nationals were introduced to Gavin through an organization called Kyle's Camp, whose goal is to raise money for the care and treatment of pediatric cancer patients at Children's National Medical Center. Last May, at a benefit Little League game put on by Kyle's Camp at Nats Park, Gavin played, had two hits, three stolen bases, and pitched a scoreless inning. Today, the Nationals released this statement saying, we hope the Rupp family finds comfort in the many happy memories they had with Gavin, including his time at Nationals Park, where he became an inspiration to us all. And funeral services for Gavin Rupp will be held on Friday. If you would like more information about Kyle's camp, just click on to our website, wjla.com. Gordon.